In the annals of history, numerous mysteries have confounded scholars and scientists alike. The intriguing enigmas of ancient times, for instance, present a vast array of questions that remain unanswered. Let's delve into the depths of these mysteries that continue to baffle us. Start with the monumental pyramids of Egypt. These colossal structures are a testament to the extraordinary architectural prowess of our ancestors. Built around 4,500 years ago, they stand tall, defying the harsh elements of time. How did the ancient Egyptians, devoid of any modern machinery, manage to construct such architectural marvels? Various theories have been proposed, from the use of intricate pulley systems to the employment of a massive workforce. Yet the exact method of their construction remains shrouded in mystery. Now let's traverse to the misty plains of England, where Stonehenge silently whispers tales of a bygone era. A circular arrangement of massive stones, some weighing as much as 25 tons, it's a monument that leaves us awestruck. Theories abound regarding its purpose, from a celestial observatory to a sacred burial ground. But the most baffling question is, how did the Neolithic people transport and erect these gargantuan stones? Despite numerous hypotheses, the true answer remains elusive. These ancient structures, the pyramids of Egypt and Stonehenge, represent a profound enigma. They hint at an advanced technological knowledge possessed by our ancestors, far beyond what we would expect from societies of such antiquity. The precision required to build these structures, the understanding of mathematics, astronomy, and engineering, all of it suggests a level of sophistication that's hard to fathom. Yet, the question persists. How did they achieve such feats? Did they possess esoteric knowledge lost to us today? Were they aided by extraterrestrial entities as some fringe theories suggest? Or was it merely the result of human ingenuity and perseverance? As we sift through the sands of history, the answers remain elusive. These ancient structures continue to puzzle us, their secrets shrouded in the sands of time. But therein lies their allure, drawing us into the enigma of ancient times, as we continue our quest for understanding. As we move forward in history, the mysteries only seem to deepen. Let's journey to the Middle Ages, a time of knights and castles, yet also a period teeming with unexplained enigmas. One such puzzle is the Voynich Manuscript, a book written in an unknown language or perhaps even a secret code that no one to date has been able to decipher. This manuscript is not just text, oh no. It's filled with peculiar illustrations of unidentifiable plants, strange constellations, and what appear to be women bathing in green pools. These illustrations only add to the enigma of the Voynich manuscript. Scholars and codebreakers alike have wrestled with this mystery for centuries, yet the manuscript continues to keep its secrets well guarded. From a perplexing book, we move to a royal conundrum. The princes in the tower, Edward V and his younger brother Richard, were last seen in the Tower of London in the summer of 1483. They were merely children, yet stood in line for the throne of England. However, they vanished without a trace, their fate unknown. Was it a plot to seize the throne? Or was it something more sinister? Theories abound, yet none can conclusively solve the mystery of these lost royals. The Middle Ages were a time of great change and development. Yet they were also riddled with unsolved phenomena that continue to baffle us today. The Voynich Manuscript and the Mystery of the Princes in the Tower are but two examples of these enigmatic occurrences. They inspire endless theories and debates, from scholarly discussions to heated controversies. Yet despite the countless hours of study and investigation, the answers remain elusive. Will we ever unravel the secrets of the Voynich Manuscript? Will we ever discover the fate of the Princes in the Tower? Or are these mysteries destined to remain unsolved, forever shrouded in the mists of the Middle Ages? The Middle Ages, a time of darkness, indeed left us in the dark about these baffling occurrences. The modern era, despite its scientific advancements, has not been without its share of unexplained phenomena. One of the most captivating mysteries of our time is the enigmatic Bermuda Triangle. This seemingly innocuous region, stretching between the points of Miami, Bermuda, and Puerto Rico, has been the backdrop to numerous inexplicable disappearances. Ships and planes alike have vanished without a trace within this maritime twilight zone, leaving no debris, no signals, and no survivors. Despite extensive investigations and scientific scrutiny, the Bermuda Triangle's secrets remain locked away, shrouded in a fog of theories that range from magnetic anomalies to extraterrestrial activity. Moving from the depths of the ocean to the shadows of society, we find another perplexing riddle the Zodiac Killer. This infamous persona, who terrorized California in the late 60s and early 70s, remains unidentified to this day. 
Despite leaving a trail of cryptic letters and coded messages, the Zodiac Killer's identity has eluded the best efforts of law enforcement and amateur detectives alike. Theories abound, with suspects ranging from the plausible to the outlandish, yet none have provided a definitive answer. The Zodiac Killer case is a chilling testament to the fact that even in an age of advanced forensics and surveillance, some secrets can still hide in plain sight. The Bermuda Triangle and the Zodiac Killer, two enigmas that continue to challenge our understanding and ignite our curiosity. They stand as stark reminders that despite the leaps and bounds of scientific progress, there are still corners of our world and aspects of our existence that remain uncharted and misunderstood. These mysteries are not just puzzles waiting to be solved, they are also humbling reminders of our inherent limitations. In the face of modern science, these mysteries stand defiant, their answers elusive. In our present day, we are not without our own share of unsolved phenomena. As we delve deeper into the cosmos, we're met with two elusive entities that continue to baffle scientists, dark matter and dark energy. These invisible forces make up a whopping 95% of the universe, yet they remain enigmatic, their very nature slipping through our understanding like sand through fingers. Dark matter, the unseen matter that doesn't interact with electromagnetic force, yet responsible for the gravitational glue holding galaxies together. Dark energy, the mysterious force accelerating the universe's expansion. Despite our best efforts, we're still grappling with these cosmic conundrums, our theories and research pushing the boundaries of our knowledge, but still not quite reaching the answer. Closer to home, within the confines of our minds, lies another profound mystery, consciousness. This phenomenon, the subjective experience of being aware and capable of thought, has remained an enigma despite centuries of philosophical debate and scientific research. Neuroscientists are continuously exploring the labyrinth of the human brain, trying to decipher the complex interplay of neurons that give rise to our thoughts, emotions, and self-awareness. Yet, the hard problem of consciousness, understanding how these physical processes translate to our subjective experiences, remains unresolved. We are in an era of unprecedented technological advancement where we can peer into distant galaxies and map the human brain in intricate detail. Yet, dark matter, dark energy, and consciousness remain elusive. These phenomena, though they may seem distant and abstract, are integral parts of our existence. They shape the universe we inhabit and define our very sense of self. In this pursuit of understanding, we are reminded of the beauty of the unknown, it propels us forward, ignites our curiosity, and fuels our collective quest for knowledge. It's a humbling reminder that even in our advanced age, there are still mysteries waiting to be unraveled, questions waiting to be answered. Even with our advanced technology and understanding, these mysteries remain, proving that we still have much to learn about our universe and ourselves. From ancient times to the present day, these unsolved phenomena captivate us, their allure undiminished by time. Just think about it. The enigma of ancient times with its perplexing structures and unexplained events continues to baffle us. Stonehenge, the pyramids, the Bermuda Triangle, their mysteries have transcended the ages, their secrets remaining elusive despite our best efforts. Then we have the mysteries of the Middle Ages, a period teeming with tales of the supernatural and unexplained. The Voynich Manuscript, the Shroud of Turin, the mystery of the princes in the tower, these riddles persist, adding layers of intrigue to an already fascinating era. In the modern era, the enigmas have taken on a new form. Crop circles, the disappearance of Amelia Earhart, the mystery of the Bermuda Triangle. They all serve to remind us that even in an age of technological advancements, there are still things beyond our comprehension. And of course, the unresolved phenomena of today, the mysteries that are unfolding before our very eyes. Dark matter, the nature of consciousness, the paradox of time travel. These are the puzzles that keep us awake at night the unknowns that fuel our curiosity and drive our quest for knowledge. These mysteries, these unsolved phenomena, are not just puzzles waiting to be solved. They are important because they teach us about our past, our present, and our future. They remind us of the limits of our understanding and the vastness of our ignorance. They inspire us to question, to explore, to push the boundaries of what is known and unknown. And amidst all this, they spark a sense of wonder, a fascination with the unknown that is as old as humanity itself. They remind us that the world is full of mysteries waiting to be unraveled, of secrets waiting to be discovered. As we continue to unravel the mysteries of our world, we are reminded that the quest for knowledge is a journey, not a destination.